This week we're here at Burke to show you our off-road caravanning, somewhere where we've never taken our caravan before. Also, we have the big wide open spaces and the beautiful scenery. Stay tuned and we show you both of the campsites that we stayed at Mays Bend. Day breaks and I'm burned by the morning light I make the same mistake more than twice Same song but brand new dance I wear out my third second chance Hi everybody and welcome back to our video this week at Burke. Look, I'll be honest, I didn't want to go to Burke at all from what the stories I heard, but I am glad that we went there. Um, it is a bit of a pity that the town itself is not really set up well. The actually main um, shopping strip is, is not very well set up and a lot of the shops are closed. And I hope you enjoy this video as we show you some of the places that we stayed at. I guess, I guess the first thing that we noticed traveling into Berg was a lot of debris on the side of the road. And what do you know, this is the culprit. I wish I hadn't known it was cotton. On the way, I would have gone along and picked it up for my stuffed toys. Don't these trucks look fascinating? So here we are at May's Bend. I wouldn't recommend coming in here if it was the really wet season as the roads look like they'd probably get pretty muddy. But there's big open spaces, plenty of places to park and pull up and plenty of areas for camping. Make sure you take some time out and have a look at some of the views that the town has to offer. Feeling a little bit more of a daredevil and want to do some four wheel driving, there's plenty of narrow tracks and off the beaten tracks that you can go camping. I tell you what, I was shitting myself, am I allowed to say that on YouTube? But I'm shitting myself that when Gil decided he wanted to go down this track so I hopped out of the car and walked it myself. Tell me, what would you have done? I thought the caravan was going to flip on top of the car. Would you have actually sat in the car with him? Or would you have done this? I don't know. I think that's why women live longer than men. I guess it was all worth it because we've got this big open space and this great campsite. Next week come along with us to Bawarana in New South Wales as we stay on the Barham River and camp on a roadside camp stop. Check out what this little town has to offer with their murals, their sculptures, their fishing traps and more. You would take my breath and I can't get it back. Face the facts, the best